TV, and today we are at Columbia College Chicago in Chicago, Illinois. Duh. So we're gonna take a tour. You ready? We gotta get hydrated, we gotta stretch it out, we gotta do a little bit power dancing. Warm up, here we go. Columbia College is located in the education corridor of downtown Chicago, Illinois. Right in the heart of the city's historic South Loop, the campus sits right next to Lake Michigan and Grant Park, the Chicago Symphony, the Theater District, and countless museums. There's a lot of things to do, especially in the summer. Um, I don't go home during the summer, so there's always fests. There's going out on the lake, there's going to Navy Pier. As you can see, the campus is clearly non-traditional. Columbia occupies 23 buildings and sits in the middle of a neighborhood that is known for its vibrancy and diversity, just like its students. Nobody's the same at Columbia. Everybody has their own personality. All of Chicago is your classroom, and you are encouraged to use the whole city as a resource. Professional internships, experiences, and opportunities are all around you and can help you build a body of work that shows off you and your talents. This is the Dance Center, one of the region's leading education centers and one of Chicago's leading presenters of world-class dance companies. Columbia College Chicago is the largest private four-year nonprofit arts, media, and communications college in the nation with 12,000 students coming from all 50 states and 41 nations. The college is incredibly diverse, socially, culturally, economically, and experientially. We are 34% minority, 3% international, 40% out of state, students from 44 countries and 50 states here, and literally every age, race, color, sex, size, if you can imagine, and you imagine how you grow as an artist and as an individual. The college believes in admitting students based on their achievements and their potential. Columbia looks at the entire applicant, not just test scores and GPA. Although ACT and SAT scores are not required for admission, students are still strongly encouraged to complete one while in high school since they can often be used as a substitute for college placement tests. Columbia's tuition is among the lowest of all private arts and media colleges in the country at just over $21,000 a year. Columbia College Chicago offers more than 120 academic majors and programs, creating a comprehensive and dynamic creative learning environment. The college is organized into three schools, the School of Fine Arts and Performing Arts, the School of Liberal Arts and Sciences, and the School of Media Arts. Columbia had this mix of being a creative art school, but at the same time you have to take um, English, philosophy, they want you to be intellectual artists, and that really attracted me. You'll have a chance to go ahead and study as many things as possible and kind of figure out exactly what you want, because you're studying your major year one rather than like three years later. When you become a junior or so, you're able to start getting your website built through them. If you need a demo reel done, pictures taken, whatever your needs are, and this is all included in tuition. So here we have the Media Production Center. One of the many super cool things going on in here is game design. GamePro named Columbia College Chicago one of the top game design schools to watch in the 2010 edition. So let's see what else we got going on. At the 2010 Emmy Awards, Columbia Journalism students took home an award in the Student News Feature category for the piece Youth Programs Aimed to Combat Chicago Violence. The commitment to social justice and to issues that really affect students now, I think, is what sets our faculty apart. It is the faculty's job at Columbia to nurture the largest concentration of young creative talent in the U.S. These industry insiders are Pulitzer Prize-winning journalists, Emmy Award-winning producers, and nationally recognized photographers, artists, designers, dancers, business owners, and community leaders. They're not relying on experience they got 50 years ago. They're relying on experience they got yesterday and they're bringing it into class today. You reap the benefits of their expertise with an intimate classroom setting of about 17 pupils. You want that networking, you want to get into that door, and meeting people at the school and getting to know the faculty is really the best way to do that. My teachers have given me gigs because like, they get gigs and they can't always take them because they're working or they've got stuff. So I just got money you know, to play music. They do care and they try to see you succeed. About 2,700 of Columbia's students live in one of the four residence centers. Like the college, the housing is completely innovative. One dorm is a renovated loft space with a graffiti room. Another hall is a luxury high-rise with full kitchens and bathrooms in every room. There are more than 80 student organizations, from the Audio Drama Club to Common Ground. The best part? They are all run by students. 700. That is the number of student performances, readings, gallery openings, concerts, productions, and screenings presented each year across campus. Seven is the number of student publications. Eight, galleries on campus putting on 75 shows a year. Whew, 
How do they find time to sleep? And while Columbia doesn't do football games or homecoming or most of those traditional college things, they do put on Manifest every May. It's an all-day urban arts walk, music festival, and street fair that attracts 30,000 people each year. There's people walking around in huge masks, like head-to-toe costumes. Like you'll be walking down the street and there'll be theater majors dressed up like um, detectives walking around secretively. <laughs> it's just really, it's really fun. It's not like anywhere else. Who went to CCC? Comedian Andy Richter, president of music for Warner Brothers Pictures, Paul Brusek, rapper Common, 30 Rock actor Scott Adist, and president of HBO Films, Len Amato, are some of the most successful alums. But the alumni network is over 96,000. Well, that's our tour of Columbia College Chicago. I hope you had as much fun as I did. I'll see you later.